You were right. You were right all along. They are jerk, bitch, asshole, narcissists. Boom. Doesn't it feel good to be right? You just needed to be right. And now that you are, everything has changed. Right? Oh, take my hand. This is what being right is all about. Woo! I've never had so much of a great time being right. Oh, being right makes me so hungry. Have some soup, being Oh! You spilled it all over, silly. Let me get that for you. I love you, being right. You make my whole life complete. What's that? Oh, now you want to go have some fun? That's great! So now what? Now that you're right, and you know you're right, what happens now? Are you going to marry being right? Are you going to make sweet, sweet love to being right? Are you going to plan the rest of your life with being right? You know, needing to place all of the blame on them so that you're right. That this is all one big illusion. So now you're right, and you still don't have what you want deep down inside. Now you're right, but what you really want isn't physically with you. Now you're right, and nothing has changed. Uh, how could this be? How could this be? You mean being right about them, being a jerk, bitch, asshole, narcissist, isn't making things change between you and your twin? It's time to go within and make changes. This journey is not different for you than it is for anyone else. You do the inner work, you make real change within, you get to be in harmonious union with your twin flame. You want real change to occur in the physical, then you have to make real changes within yourself. You have to do the inner work to do that, the mirror exercise. If you aren't willing to do that, then you have nothing to complain about. And you have no one to blame but yourself. You want to be right? Go be right. If that's so important to you, if that means so much to you, you want to drop that facade and have true love, then it's time to step up to the plate and make changes. Waiting around for something to change is not going to happen. This isn't a journey of waiting. It is one of change and transformation. You have to do the work. You have to make those changes within yourself. It takes your choice and your effort to get this done. So do you want an imaginary twin flame? Or do you want the real thing? Do you want to just have this idea of your perfect life in your head and never get to experience it? Or do you really want to experience it? Click the links below for help. Use the resources to stop your suffering, and I will see you next time.